I have another killer stock pick today, and this one is another clean energy solar stock pick with insane patents. This company has strong ties to the state and federal government. I'll show you that proof at the end of the video. They have a $80 million solar farm in the works and a new plant that's actually active right now that turns medical waste into electricity. Subscribe and like this video. Give this video a quick like right now to help the cause and turn on the notification bell to instantly get access access to these amazing stock picks. I've recently just called stocks that have ended up going triple percentage points in the next day or two. This company we're talking about here has products that are 40 to 50% more effective than its competitors, and it's a very small cap stock. So watch the entire video so I can explain that to you. Stick around for the whole video to see their insane patents and government ties. Getting into the website, first of all, they just updated their website. As you can see here, 8, 18 p.m. January 29th, Sun Pacific holding corp has updated their website okay they just said this this is the new website it looks very good we're not going to talk too much about their website because there is so much news to talk about about this stock they have three subsidiaries these are all pretty similar these first three and then med recycler stay tuned for that as video watch about that med recycler that is very very interesting it's basically turning waste into electricity but in a completely different form and nobody's ever done it before in the u.s if you click any three of these it will bring you to this page so let's talk about this for strategy and vision sun pacific power builds competitively priced next generation solar panels and lightning products made primarily in the usa sun pacific power has eight worldwide manufacturing and assembly locations including five in the united states that is a lot for such a small cap and we're going to talk about the ticker and i'm going to show you the chart let's get through the website first they have solar products solar powered bus shelters solar powered led trash bins and lightning products so they have many different products for such a small cap company and and I'm not going to read all this to you. You guys can definitely check this out. Either pause the screen or click the link in the description. But we're going to get right into the massive news and all the stuff that they do because there is a lot more important information to talk about other than just reading through this whole website because that is not really interesting. Nobody wants to see that. We will talk about the Med Recycler more towards the end of the video. So I'm just going to present this to you to show you what it looks like. But we're going to talk about the end of the video. It's basically where they turn waste into renewable energy and they use that for their solar plants and solar panels. So they're basically getting free energy essentially. This stock was really quiet for about two years because the solar panels were still in development and they were waiting to get their patents approved. They did not get the patent granted until late 2019 and early 2020. So just recently they got their patents approved. That's why it's getting a lot of recognition now. They applied for the waste to energy plant in 2018, but it took until 2020 to get that approved. After the approval, all these things are just now starting to get recognition because COVID hit right when they got their patents approved. And obviously every company got hit hit and nobody was really that interested in investing in solar companies right when COVID hit. Nobody. It hit them hard, delayed some projects. That explains the no price action for years. Taking a look at the chart, it's up 2.21% today at 9 cents. It was actually up to 34 cents. It took a massive drop down here and it's just now leveling out. I really like to see it leveling out. That's why I'm making the video now because it's a good time to buy. It had a lot of big players get in and out because they heard about the news and then they took profit. That doesn't really mean anything for the long term i really do think this stock has an insane long-term growth i'm about to tell you why i'm about to show you all the reasons why and there's so many different reasons so stay tuned for the whole video the ticker is s n p w add this to your watch list right now as you're watching this video the patented solar panels are 40 to 50 percent lighter and 40 percent cheaper to manufacture than the traditional glass panels that saves a lot of money and the potential there is obvious the uses and applications are for buildings homes, solar highway barriers, vehicles, portables, for example, like a school portable or many other portables, military uses, camping, like camping devices, military uses for lighting, all types of different stuff. I have two clips of the CEO back in 2017 and 2019 explaining this to you. So I'm going to play those clips in this video right now. This is the patent. I'm not going to go through this entire patent, but it says right here, National Mechanical Group Corp. That is one of their subsidiaries. Take a look at the patent in the description and you can go through this whole thing. It talks about the solar here, the solar panel construction, 
production. This is a patent for their solar panels. Link will be in the description if you do want to check this out yourself. I'm going to play two clips right now. I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to let you listen and listen to the CEO back in 2017. And this one is back in 2018. Just listen to this. Remember, I told you the patents didn't get approved until 2019 and 2020. That is why this video was uploaded so long ago, because that's when they started assembling and creating these patents and panels. And now they are starting to get approved. That's why the hype is there at the company. Listen to this. This is really, really great information for you to hear. Is, uh, um, with our smart technology, um, our solar panels that we're designing now are um, lightweight, uh, almost 40 to 40% 40 to 50% lighter than traditional panel. So what we're looking to do is uh, incorporate them as building facades, as well as incorporate them on roof. I came up with a non-glass solar panel, which is about 50% less weight and it's going to cost 40% less to manufacture. And we're hoping to be able to create that and manufacture that here in the U.S. So as you can see here, he did mention that they are 40 to 50% lighter and 40% cheaper to manufacture these solar panels. A lot of money to be saved there. That is very, very great news. And the patents have just recently got approved. That's why there wasn't a lot of hype when they were just submitting the patents. When they're just submitting it, it doesn't mean anything. But when they get approved like they have now, it means a lot. Here are some pictures of the panel. This is in greenhouse. All these very, very light solar panels over here. This is the bus stop panels. Basically what they plan to do with these bus stop panels and they plan to put advertisements on top of the bus stop and companies pay them to basically advertise their company. And you guys know all over the US and all over the world, there is tons of bus stops, people waiting at buses. So if they put an advertisement on top and have a company pay them for the advertisement, that's a source of revenue. Also another little picture here of the very very light solar panel this is a smaller form of it now that you guys have an idea of the solar panels and the solar panels they're using the cheap light solar panels this is the project they have in 2019 they created and started an 80 million dollar project for solar farm in durango mexico the current partnership was established to co-develop a 10 to 40 plus megawatt solar farm in durango mexico so they have a 80 million dollar solar farm the ceo did say we are very pleased to have identified and started due diligence with a potential funding source and partner for the project in Durango, Mexico. We look forward to working with them as they move through their underwriting analysis and site visit. At Sun Pacific, a key strategy for us is to identify opportunities and build partnerships that can allow us to utilize creative financing alternatives to build value for our stakeholders through the management and or equity profit sharing arrangements in those partnerships. They partnered with this company to add value to shareholders, add value to their company and they're always looking for key strategic partners and this 80 million dollar project is one of their biggest projects they have yet i think it actually is their biggest project fast forward a little bit to 2020 snpw announced that they are teaming up with an advertising industry leader focus media group to expand marketing awareness to boost revenue growth for this solar panel project talking about the solar farm that i was just talking about the durango mexico solar farm has upgraded from 40 megawatts to 50.4 megawatts. It was last reported in 2019 that they only run this plant with five employees, but just recently reported in 2020, they've already hired or are hiring 30 to 40 extra employees, which is a massive expansion for their solar farm. So obviously this company is expanding. They plan to continue to expand and they plan to try to continue to increase their revenue. Now that you know about their solar farm, their $80 million solar farm, that is their main source of revenue. Let's take a look at Med Recycler, their other subsidiary that actually turns the waste into renewable energy for their solar panel farm. Med Recycler is a leading edge processing facility that will turn waste into renewable energy. This is very, very smart business move here. Think about it. If you already have a solar panel farm, to have a facility that turns waste into renewable energy, which is electricity, it will only bring up your profits and increase your revenue. I did do more research other than just their website on this. Let me show you what I have found. The Med Recycler facility does not use incineration. That means there are no fumes from burning the waste. It is a closed loop system and one of the first facilities in the US like this. It is always enticing to hear that a very, very small company is one of the 
first to do anything like this. Med Recycler Facility will handle up to 70 tons, which is $42,000 worth of waste every day, which is $15 million in annual revenue. That's straight pure revenue. They will sell power back to the grid, the Durango, Mexico grid that we just talked about. They will also have the ability to expand and two times their operation, and they would need to revisit their permit. And when they choose to do this and expand, it'll bring in double 140 tons per day and $30 million in revenue. And they definitely, definitely seem like they plan to do this. They look like they're on the track to continue to expand. So I wouldn't be surprised if they got an extra $30 million in revenue. So this is an extra massive source in revenue along with their Durango, Mexico, power grid it adds up to 15 to 30 million dollars in extra revenue every year i did want to mention this to you they are a pink otc stock they are verified their transfer agent is verified so this is obviously an all legitimate company now let me show you these political ties that i was talking about this is very extremely interesting their ceo nicholas Campanella. The CEO of SNP's attorney is Joseph Shikari, the majority leader of the Rhode Island House of Representatives, the most powerful political office in the state of Rhode Island. Go down to here. The Rhode Island governor is Biden's secretary of commerce and longtime close friend to Shikari. So these two guys are very connected. And guess what? She has a connection directly to Biden. Here's a picture of Gina and Joe t chilling together. So there it is. You see that here, Gina, the attorney, and then you have the CEO of SNPW. So they are all connected in that form. Also, former New Jersey mayor and Baltimore Ravens special team coach, Randy Brown, owns 7.8% of SNPW since April, 2020. Former New Jersey mayor, own 7.8% of SNPW. So he sees something in this company that is very good news to see insider information buying, corporate buying. And this connection right here, this is crazy. If you think about it, this company, SNPW, might actually get a lot of attention from Gina. And she has direct connection to this man right here, Joe Biden, and he is the president. SNPW has fully audited financials and it's fully SEC reporting. You guys can check that out yourself. Many OTC stocks don't even do this and are not current. This makes it seem like they are planning to uplist in the future, which would mean a minimum price of $1 per share. That would be insane gains for us. And honestly, I think that's possible. I think a dollar per share is definitely doable. That would be 100x or more. That would be massive. Now that you guys know about the Durango Power Grid, Med Recycler, where they turn waste into electricity and clean energy. This stock is so, so enticing. I really, really like this. I'm gonna be holding this long-term. I'm gonna be holding it for over a year probably. If it does get to a dollar, maybe take profits. I really do think in a year this will be a dollar. I'm being dead serious on this. I don't really give price predictions like this, but this one specifically is so, so enticing. The expansion is there. The connections to a high level political figures are there. This one is very, very awesome. I love this stock so much, and I'm gonna be buying in at these levels. Anything right now at nine cents, I'd say six to nine cents is a very, very, insanely good price to be getting into this stock. If you do want some free stocks, okay, I am not saying that this stock, SNPW is not on Webull, it is on TD Ameritrade, it is on Fidelity, but if you do want four free stocks with value up to $3,700, go down to the description, it's a Webull sign up link, you click this right here, and it brings you here. You get four free stocks. All you have to do is open an account and fund your account with just $100, and you pretty much automatically get $50, but it could be up to 3,700 because if you get a bunch of Apple stocks, which is actually possible, you can get a Google stock, Facebook or Starbucks, a Google stock is like $1,000. Definitely, definitely do this. This will give you free money and it, you can sell these stocks and then buy more penny stocks on a different exchange. So definitely, definitely click that link and claim your free stocks, get some free money. Go ahead and check me out on Patreon. I did announce this stock on my Patreon before I even uploaded this video. Follow me on Twitter because after I upload the video, I still continue to just talk about my stock picks. So follow me on Twitter, follow me on Stock Twitch, and check out my two previous videos. They're linked in the description below. These are also very good penny stocks that still have news coming. All the penny stocks I upload about have real world news. So definitely go ahead and click these two links and check out these videos. Shout out to my most recent Patreons. I always shout out my new Patreons, Bonton, Chaos, Andrew Keen. Andrew Keen, big shout out to you. Pan, 
Mario, Jing Wang, Today's Production, Ken Chani, Vimy K, Eileen Nicole, Randy, Joe Pop, and Apple Crisp. Thank you guys so much for hitting that Patreon subscription. If you guys do want to, that's the best way to directly support me. Check out ticker SNPW. This one is massive. I really, really like this stock. They have amazing room to grow here. And it's Joe Biden's years in office. These clean energy stocks are gonna be doing very, very well in the next four years. So definitely add this to your watch list ASAP. And that is it for the video. Peace out.